Okay, I came down here last night and I fiberglassed this mold that I was working on uh, last. This is one that I've done previously. So what I want to do is I'm going to open these up and um, pull out these uh, these heads. These are interchangeable. And they work from different bodies that I have. It allows me a little bit of flexibility and from these uh, castings I build and sculpt a whole myriad of, a myriad of uh, different expressions or whatever uh, a customer's want as much as I can. I get, you can see I got a lot of loose fiberglass. Now this is fiberglass resin. This is not the two-part moisture cured that I was referring to that I actually used to make the shell. This was the initial casting off of this and here's where I cut the mold like I told you. Instead of cutting it all the way around I just cut it up the middle so I'd have limited uh, seam repair to to work with. Now just loosen this up. And we'll see what the piece see if everything come out good. Takes a little bit of wrangling. Okay. Got a few little repairs to do on this one, which you normally do, but this was the mold that I was telling you about. This is exactly what I want. I want very little to have to repair because over this, I'm going to do, you know, I can do all kinds of re-sculpting, uh, which allows me to create whole varieties of, uh, of different looks. So we'll put this back. Set this off to the side right now. And we're going to open this one up. This one actually has been done for a while. I just hadn't opened it up. And these are created with um, like a paste material that uh, that I make. And it's just a basic um, old school type um, fiberglassing. A lot of mold making. The molds on the molds on this head was made just a little bit uh, different than the molds on this one. That was more time spent on this one than it was on this one. Even though I've basically got the same uh, result, this is this one right here has a lot of little bells and whistles on it. Has a few extra bells and whistles on it. Uh, that this one does not have, but I was I was a little bit pushed for time, but I still come up with pretty much what I wanted. Okay, here's the other one. 
So you just got just a little bit of difference on this. This one, I made this a little bit heavier. Just totally different facial uh, facial looks on this. Clean up on both of them, but basically that's exactly what I want. So we put these things back together and get the body, uh, take the body and finish forming it, sculpting on it, prepping it, and then I'll add the heads. And that's where we're at right now on uh, on this project.